Marty Morrissey is in this. You've, yeah. given, you've given him his big screen debut. So what are Marty's acting chops like? It's really funny because uh, Marty was the last one cast, really, and he was written in the script as himself. And mm. John Kenny is in the film as well, the yeah. comedy Irish oh. legend. John, yeah. love him to bits. And Johnny sa or John said to me, you know, I see Marty's in the script. Is, is he in the movie? And I said, <laughs> well, I'd love him to be in it. One second. And he picked up his phone. And I could hear him outside going, Marty, I'm doing this Philip in water with this young fella. You have to do it. You just have to do it. And I was like, oh, great. So next thing, Marty rang me. And he said, you know, I hear you want me to be in your film. And I said, yeah, I'd love you to be in the film. And he said, well, look, send me the script. So we, we, we got him anyway. And he turned up on the day three hours late. <laughs> And, uh, Whoa, already a star. Very a already celeb. a star. Oh, yeah, 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 I, I yeah. wasn't expecting anything less from Marty, in fairness. <laughs> yeah. he, he, sw he swanned in, legend that he is, three hours late, and then said, Tony, uh, have you got a script for me? <laughs> and I said, would, would that be the script I sent you a month ago, Marty? <laughs> oh, yeah, I didn't get a chance to learn it. So we were obviously all panicking yeah. um, because it was the last sh uh, shot of the day and we had a very tight three-week schedule that we needed to get everything done in. Mm. Uh, and then I just handed him the, the script because I, you know, it was the director as well. And, oh, uh, there he is. Yeah, there he is, yeah. And John Milan, of course, as well. Waterford legend John Milan. And, uh, yeah, so Marty basically said, am I holding this clip clipboard in the scene? And I said, yeah, Marty. And he said, right, one second. He starts writing his lines down. And I just went, Lever. oh, Jesus. I looked at the AD and he just did this. <laughs> I looked at the sound man and he just did this. I said, no, look, let's go for one anyway. And I'm not joking with you, Marty got it one take. Wow. Oh. One take. Not only the, the Marlon Brando of Irish cinema, yeah. Marty Morrissey. Well, now, let's get back to this bang to the head, Tony. Oh, God. What happened? Uh, well, I, I like to say that only I could make a film about hurling and be in a hurling club and get concussed by a window. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it was the second last day of filming and I came in and they had a, a skylight open. To let, it was actually one of the rare sunny days we have here in Ireland. Mm. And uh, I went in kind of going, lads, we're behind schedule, let's go. And, and I went, I'm going to get my own makeup done in a minute. And I was walking towards the makeup artist, Sarah, mm. and I just absolutely clocked myself <laughs> off, the, off the skylight, oh. which just happened to be the exact same height as yeah. the top of my head. Just, have you scar? Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I don't know. They're all inside. No, I, I, they're all inside. They're all, yeah, they're all, inside. they're all in here in my heart. Um, no, I. It was just. It was just mad. And I'll be honest with you. Like if I saw someone banging into a window, I'd laugh because that's. Yeah, funny. I know. It's terrible. We do that, isn't it? Yeah, but like no one even laughed. It was just oh, like. Oh no! Oh, because oh. it was. It was a. <laughs> <laughs> I actually hurt my side. <laughs> no, and being honest with you, like you just hit your head and you're going to go look. That it was kind of sore. It's grand. Let's get on with it. And I kind of, as the day was going on, I was going, I don't feel great. But look, we've only one day left. Mm. And then the next day was your last day as well. It was all, it was all of our last days. And I was talking to Carl and uh, Elva Trill, who's the lead actress in the movie, and some of the lads from Dice Men Productions, who were the production company we made it with. And they're like, are you OK? And I was like, Where, where's Carl? And I was just a bit all over the place. Yeah. Like, we did that scene. And then Carl kind of said, I know we're going for a few drinks afterwards, Tony, <laughs> but would you maybe go to the hospital and get yourself checked first? And I did, and it just turned out that I was, uh, I was concussed. Yeah, yeah well, it was, must have been a very strange experience because you don't really know what's going on and you wouldn't probably expect it. Yeah. So he's dying to see the film. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, and funny enough, it was the day with Marty. It was yeah. the day with Marty. So I was kind of glad he was three hours late because I could gather myself. Yeah. And then the next day, it was kind of like I went to sleep right after we did the thing with Marty and I mm. woke up in the middle of the next day, genuinely. I yeah. don't remember the first yeah. half of the next day yeah. at all.